If you want to start a YouTube, start it today as you see this video. Start it right now. Stop waiting until the next week, the next day, the next hour. Start it right now. What's good, y'all? What is good? Appreciate y'all for tapping into another video, man. Don't mind the hair. You know, we get by the time y'all see this video, I'm going to have a cut. But if you didn't tap into my live on Tuesday, y'all will know I'm strictly getting in only lineups in the front and on the beard. That's it. If you want to know the reason why, go tap it to the live because we really locked in right now. And trust me, like this is going to pay off for sure. I want to talk to y'all because if you really watching this video, start a YouTube channel. I know you watching this because you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel. You've been debating on starting a YouTube channel. I'm telling y'all, start a YouTube channel. Starting a YouTube channel has been the best thing that's ever happened to me. I'm not even lying to y'all. I'm not even lying. I'm being 100% real with y'all. I wish, I wish I started this years ago. I wish I started this during COVID, but one, I just wasn't confident. I didn't want to put myself out there and I was afraid of what people were going to say. And that's me being real with y'all. I was afraid of what people were going to think if I started a YouTube. To this day right now, I promise you, I do not care what people say about my content. Obviously, if I get constructive criticism back, I'm going to take it learn you know what i'm saying try to improve each and every way but when people just come out here trying to hate bro i don't even listen to it you know what i'm saying it used to get me mad at the beginning when i first started but now and you know i was kind of hesitant about what i should post what i shouldn't post because of what people might say but it's like bro this is my channel you know what i mean this is what i want to talk about whoever wants to listen whoever wants to hate is just like bro you just giving me more attention to my page regardless you know what i mean and it's not about the attention i'm just on here to share my story and my journey with people who who want to who can relate and who want to just get to know me more i feel like i'm the most vulnerable on youtube than i am off the camera crazy i'm so confident and just willing to let y'all know about me and get to know me through this camera through this platform and it's like youtube really has saved my life because people are like why do you do youtube because it's an outlet for me it's something that I love. It's something that I'm passionate about. It's something that I want to continue to grow in and get better and better and better. And I know I can get better. I hold myself back more times than not because I haven't put myself out of my comfort zone to where I know I can really take this to the next level. And I and I starting like right now. You know what I'm saying? Like one thing I was hesitant about because again, I was caring what people were thinking was recording myself working out at the gym or recording myself out in public. Most of my videos, if y'all don't know, is in this, in my, in my place, in the crib. Easier to talk with no distractions. You know, people aren't watching. But then again, I ask myself, why do I care what people think? You can't, if you want to get into YouTube, you can't care about what people think. You just got to post whatever you want to post. Whether it gets 20 views, 2,000 views, 100,000 views, a million views, no views. It's like, bro, post whatever you want. Not every video you post is going to be a hit. I'm telling y'all that right now. Videos that I've posted, that I thought were gonna do extremely well or that I put you know, some thought and effort into, probably do the worst and that's okay. I, I used to let it get to me back when I first started, but now I'm like, bro, whoever watches it, watches it, whoever doesn't, doesn't. It's what I wanna put out, you know what I mean? I know certain people tell me what they wanna see and what I should do, but it's like, I appreciate the feedback and I always take that into account, but at the end of the day, like I'm gonna do what I think is best for me. And if you guys don't want to watch that, that's okay. Let me get back on track. Like, start that YouTube channel, man. You don't know what it could do for your life. Because I know for me personally, if I'm feeling some type of way, or I just want to talk about how God has been a blessing, whether it's something that good that's happened in my life or something that, you know, is tragic or bad, like, I want to be able to put that out there because I know I'm not the only one dealing with this. And I know I can help somebody in some way, I don't care if it's one person, I don't care if it's a hundred people, all I wanna do is help as many people as I can through my videos. And it's like, you have a gift. You have a gift that you probably don't even realize. And you won't even realize it until you start a YouTube. You never know. If you enjoy watching other people's videos and you saying to yourself, man, I wish I could do that. You can do that. You could do whatever you want. You could start a channel right now as you're watching this. All you gotta do is just upload one video and continue to be consistent and continue to go for it. I tell my boy, Elijah, if you watching this, bro, post more videos. Y'all be having YouTube channels, you'll post a video and then go ghost for like two months because it didn't do as well as you thought and like you're just in your head like trying to put out the perfect video. There's no such thing as a perfect video. You gotta just put out content that you like. 
Forget what if other people are gonna like it because then you put it in out for the wrong reasons. You're putting it out so other people can validate you. It's like, bruh, only person who's ever gonna be able to validate me is God. I'm putting out this content because I'm here to show y'all how my life is with God, what I'm going through, it's battling spiritually, you know, mentally, physically, all of it. That's just what I wanna do. I wanna help inspire, motivate, and just pick anybody up. That's what I want my videos to do. When you see my video pop up, I wanna be like, yeah, Isaiah dropped a video, let's get it. I don't care if it's one person saying that, a thousand people saying that, like, I'm just here to try to make a difference. And I know once I started YouTube, I was like, yo, this is my purpose. And when you find that purpose, it's the biggest blessing or one of the biggest blessings that can happen to anybody is finding that purpose. So I tell y'all to tell y'all, man, you don't even know what capabilities you have if you start a YouTube channel. You don't gotta be what I do. You don't gotta be talking like me about certain experiences in life. If you love fashion, throw some fashion videos out there, do a little haul. If you love working out, do gym videos. Just because you see other people doing it and you think that yours won't be as good, you don't know that. You just have to keep going because not everybody is gonna be, you know, attracted to your videos, but you're gonna have people who mess with your videos if you're doing what you're supposed to be doing into being authentic. I mean, I ain't trying to have a whole world on my page. I just want people who mess with my content who can relate to me on it. That's it. If it grows, it grows. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But I'm going to keep working because I want to continue to reach as many people as I can who want or feel attracted to my videos enough to subscribe. Like, that's it. That's it. Stop being afraid to start a YouTube. Stop being afraid to put yourself out there. Put your talents out there. Put the gifts that God gave you out there for people to see. What good is it if you holding it inside and you not letting it out? Me making this video is probably inspiring someone right now to make a YouTube channel. You know what I mean? If I were just to say, you know, I'm not going to make this video, that person may not have seen it and they may never start a YouTube. You never know who you're going to hit with your videos that's going to inspire them to want to start a passion, a hobby, something that they love. I ain't even saying you got to start a YouTube. You start whatever you want, but you got to start today. If you want to start a YouTube, start it today as you see this video. Start it right now. Stop waiting until the next week, the next day, the next hour. Start it right now. Because all it takes is just for you to start, drop a video, and just be consistent. And before you know it, you're going to be like, damn, I got like 50 videos uploaded. Don't worry about the numbers. Don't worry about the subscribers, the views, the likes. Don't worry about that. If you're passionate about it, you don't care about that. Don't worry about if it's going to make you money or not. Whatever you're passionate about, you gotta do it for the love, not for what comes with it. That stuff will come over time. That stuff will come over time. I'm not, I'm not stressing if what I want out of this doesn't come because at the end of the day, I'm doing what I love and you need to be doing what you love too. But I know a lot of people wanna be content creators. A lot of people wanna do YouTube. A lot of people want to have a platform to speak on. You can, that's what social media is for. That's what YouTube is for. You have the freedom to talk about whatever you want. Not everybody's gonna agree, and that's what I had to understand. Not everybody's gonna mess with my content, not everybody's gonna agree with what I have to say, and that's okay, because it's just my platform. And I wanna help people as best as I can on my platform, who can relate, who need, may need guidance, who may need a little bit of motivation. That's all I'm here for, is just to help, help whoever I can through my videos. And just entertain people, you know what I'm saying? I think. My life isn't as entertaining as I want it to be, but I think I have a lot of wisdom. I think I have a lot of stuff and knowledge to say to help y'all. And I ask God every day to allow him to speak through me to y'all. Whoever needs to see my videos to help whatever they're going through, allow them to reach that certain person. I don't care who it is. If my video can help one person get through whatever they battling with, I'm doing my job. I'm fulfilling my purpose. That's all that matters. You don't know what you're capable of until you actually start something. And yes, if you fail, you fail, but you gotta get up and keep going. My videos have crashed and burned. There's videos I've failed on multiple times. Like I said, that I thought we were gonna do good, but you just have to keep going. Don't let the numbers and what everyone says about, oh, it's hard and it takes so long to blow up. Like, who cares? If you love it, just do it for the love. All that stuff will come when it's God's time and when God says, you know what, you ready to get to that next level? You're gonna be ready, but you gotta start. Take a risk. Stop being afraid. I'm telling y'all, YouTube will change your life. If you want to be a creator, if you want to post whatever it is that inspires you, just do it. 
Who cares what people say? Who cares what they think? The more you care, the less you will actually go forward with wanting to put stuff out there. You can't care. You got to have thick skin. Everyone's going to have an opinion. Just do what you got to do, man. Be yourself. Be authentic. And I promise you the right people will follow through. That's my cue to get off of here because these damn leaf blowers and landscapers be messing up the, be messing up the videos. So I'm going to get out of here, y'all. I love y'all. Stay blessed.